Hello, welcome back. So as you can see, we have a bit of an army right now. I changed the mages, and we have one more firehand golem, and also a few more knights. Now, <laughs> this is one of the most silly quests ever made. As you can see, you are supposed to match the runes, and it took me a while to figure it out, but the thing is, you just have to find the runes that are shown over here. So what are the runes shown over there? Well, is this one. Well, let's continue. And the next one is kind of like the inverted uh, katana well, thingy, not well. katana, sai. Now you have to find four of these as well. Uh, it's kind of hard to remember them anyway, but yeah. I'll just show you the way to that. I mean, there are so many runes over here, you'd think this is a very complex puzzle. No, it's not. It's not complex at all. They just right. made it go in, go in the front, then go in the back. By the way, to kind of throw you off your game, there was a rune inside here as well, so why? Why would they make so many traps for you? I don't know. This puzzles are simplistic. Yes, that's correct. This seems almost like a never-ending game of torture, if you ask me, but hey. Well, let's continue. By the way, the game lets you actually activate this rune and the other rune without uh, doing anything. So I could activate uh, these two runes. But I could not advance, well, so... let's continue. The game is a lot more... Uh, how should I put it? Well, the game is more linear than you think, so to let you do a lot of other things. So yeah, that was three anarchy points. Let's talk, man. That means you'll no longer be able to attack the spirits. Look. That's your signature at the bottom of this letter granting access to the Mage Factory. Maybe you should talk after all, eh? Yes, the letter is mine. I, I'll tell you the truth. My daughter Teresa is severely ill. Our healers were unable to help her, but I'd heard of someone in Artisania. I'm so sorry, but your dealings with a certain noble couple ended up killing everyone in the Mage Factory. And I'd venture to guess they were none other than Albert and Ursula. They promised to pay for Teresa's treatment. In return, I was to create a special poison for them. You see, I uncovered a secret of the Dark Adepts. The Mage Factor named it the Widow's Kiss. I haven't a clue why. The poison drives its victims to fits of insanity. Strange name for it. I told Albert numerous times he needed to use Lorianese glass flasks, but he never listened. Poor old fellow. I wonder if he's still alive. Palatinus, focus! You destroyed the Mage Factory. How did it happen? Yes, of course. I, I, I just need to focus. Those greedy aristocrats. They demanded I make them more poison. As if one order wasn't enough. Because of them, I was in a rush, and then... The boiling flask burst right in front of me, poison spraying everywhere. Well, they ran, of course. Oh, creator, the sound of those screams coming through the window. Dreadful. How did you survive, then? I had time to take the antidote. There was little enough of it, but it was effective. And if my hands weren't shaking, I'd buy the elements. I remember nothing more. Why did I come here? You appeared to be making poison for Albert and Ursula. What else? No, no, no! I, I know I'm making an antidote. I must eliminate Widow's Kiss to the last drop. This poison must be destroyed. It... But wait! Only my retort burst. The second was in Ursula's hands. That's it! They still have the Widow's Kiss! You must find them immediately! Well, that doesn't make any sense, but hey, let's <laughs> let's have a story for the sake of having a story. I beg of you. I mean, all of this for a simple potion that drives people mad. Okay, let's go and question also, because again, the main way to play the game is to do the main quest, because everything else will become easy after a while. My boy. You get a lot of experience, a lot of money, you get access to new stuff. I've had such a good... 
And yeah, I'm basically destroying my character build at this point, but, you know, in order to have... In order to have kind of like the quest that the people don't usually do on video, well, I kind of have to suffer a little what does bit. That mean, dear heart? It means... This was to be expected. I am so sorry, my bright daffodil. But this is the end for us. Ursula, please be calm. I will deal with this. Now you listen to me. To begin, the disaster was not caused by the poison. Palatinus is wrong. That's not why it happened. Second, we don't have the retort. We left it back at the foundry. You'd better not lie to me again. Yes. What else? I'll tell you everything. That's him? Yes. You see, we weren't the only nighttime guests at the Mage Factory. We were just fetching the order when I stumbled upon some horrible ritual. And the explosion! We ran outside and that spirit attacked us. It was furious! Ursula dropped the boiling flask. Palatinus saved us. He subdued the spirit with a spell and had let us go. We left the flask behind at the Mage Factory. <laughs> What's the relevance I of that? I find you more believable this time. What happened next? We were at Castle Arden. Palatinus fled right away, and the spirit... What was his name? Ador. That was what Palatinus called him. That is the spirit's true name, Ador. Unfortunately, before I could command this entity, it called for help. More spirits appeared, and we ran. Oh, how we ran. And then... What else could we do? We spent our last coin on that poison. I find it difficult to trust you. Once a liar, always a liar. If you need a witness, talk to Ador. He will tell you we're telling the truth. What? We told you everything. You won't put us in chains after we've been so helpful to your investigation, will you? I wish I could, but interrogating Ador is of far greater importance. Your fate will be decided by His Highness Prince Adrian. Off to the gallows then. You must believe. Find. A I do not. Sorry. Well, <laughs> that didn't go well for us. And I have to go and tell Palatinus about the secret of why I was just there. Can we just use some magic to communicate telepathically? Well, I guess this would be faster. Yeah, it will be the same, but I forgot where the right direction is. So right now we're actually uncovering the secrets of the game, so after about... I don't even want to think about how many hours. We're actually uncovering the secrets of what happened to the Mage Factory. Okay, he's still here and relatively Did sane. Him? Did you get the retort? The spirit Ador knocked the retort from Ursula's grasp. She left the mage factory empty-handed. Oh no. It fell on the floor then. That's even worse. The retort may have been damaged. If so, the poison will start seeping out and spread around the mage factory. And then, who knows how many more people will go mad from breathing in its miasma. The widow's kiss has already destroyed the mage factory. No, good sir. Your poison isn't what wiped out the Mage Factory. There's no trace of poison or plague in there. What's happening in the Mage Factory is something entirely different and sinister. Yet you're a mage. Go there yourself and destroy this poison. I, I can't. can't. No one can. The Mage Factory is quarantined by Kaythorn's magic and a whole army of mages. Besides, I can't even remember how to get to the Mage Factory. My mind's on fire. I need to neutralize the poison, and quickly. But how can I do that with the Widow's Kiss still inside the Mage Factory? Find the retort, and your reward will be generous. You have my word. You're giving me the money of those people that have no money? <laughs> okay, weird dialogue, weird story choices. But it's a nice room over here. I wish I could go in the basement and eat some delicious stew and then take a nap in the cool air, but nope. After adventure, we go again. 
Yeah, I'm kind of uh, stretching my units a bit because we do need to use the swordsman and the crossbowman, but we don't have anything better. Slightly weaker enemy. I'm, mm, we can we can use the house cards if need be. Actually, they deal a very little damage. Scratch that. Oh, the flame floor door. So I wish I could have some of these. The free archers. Well, they are more like rogue archers or evil archers. Okay, let's fight them. We actually start flanked. Oh, that's interesting. Now let's cast an interesting spell. Okay, so why why is that castle over there with its oh drawbridge? Oh, okay, I understand what it is now. Fire and cold saturation. Hit and run, right? Well, that was not so bad. Now, what about these guys? Eh, they have the same attack and the same animation. It's just a different, a slightly different energy ball. Okay, now we can fight. Sorry about being quiet, but yeah. fights that are too easy are not so interesting. Besides, the game is not really going in a good direction. It appears that the developers really are in some kind of a trouble or misunderstanding with the with the rest of the develop with the with the publisher and also the investors. I mean, I'm not sure what's happening, but it appears like the. The publisher and the investors simply put to take just one more money. And the publishers... Well, they basically say what to do with the game and the updates. So yeah, right now I think they're scrambling to either make the DLC or to actually prepare for the DLC by doing bug fixes. But that's actually harder than it seems. Because we still didn't get a difficulty update. I'll call it update, it's not a patch, it's an update or maybe an extra content patch. Oh, my mistake. So yeah, the, there's not much news about the game currently, it's only... Arching shot, oh that's nice. Oh, 
Okay, that's bad. What was I saying? Oh yeah. Wait, dwarfs over here? Why? Now we have the... Oh, they look so weird and so... I mean, they should be ordering a lot more cool stuff. Berserkers. 700 leadership. Hmm, they're actually decent. Four of them, eh, decent. Yeah, bear riders. They have the tone skill. Very interesting because the bird kind of has this amount of HP. The damage is a bit low. I mean, you can only have three of them. Anyway, here's how we get more doors, I guess. The game really wants you to make factionaries, but the factionaries are not so great after all. Mindy Port. Interesting, let's go on, let's... Oh, I need to use the Night Sword as well, so what is over here? Yeah, let's explore the castle, that sounds like the most interesting part of the situation. At this point we don't have much of a quest, to be honest. Pickaboo. Well, I think the game could have been a little better if the developers were uh, kind of allowed to make shorter, faster so, patches. Three signs of Alm, then a dash, or is it two dashes? Okay, that's weird. Oh, so this is how big a troll really is. Looks like he likes eating barbecue. Yeah, I don't prefer he uses a, we he uses a weapon. Three signs of Alm, then a dash. Two dashes. This huge oak is a regular concentration. Stupid and black. Can you get up one? Okay, where is that question? Oh, 
Oh, Altar of Mages and it's the Grey Knight. Oh, I have to do the, the other quest to get that quest. So, three signs of all, then a dash, and then two dashes. This huge oath. Ah, oh, familiar face. You look like you want to boost your armed power. I remember you. You were a disciple at the Mage's Tower. What brings you here? Long story. They kicked me out, but now I've found the real trade. Trolls, raw force, the endurance of stone, and total obedience. No one has ever tamed a troll. Until now. Except that guy we I bought trolls from. I can tame them. Once I have the final ingredient, I'll be taming trolls with a snap of my finger. I have trouble believing that. What thing do you lack? The, the stone ear of worry. Of, uh... I've read that this stone so terrifies trolls in its presence, a troll's mind goes soft as clay. These stones are said to be sentient and hide when they hear footsteps. I also read that they can be found along the riversides in Middle Ruin. A trip to Ruin is out of the question right now. Too many beasts and brigands. But as soon as I can manage it, I'll be in the business of selling trolls. The most important thing is to keep the stones at a distance. Otherwise, the enchantment might get out of control. Hmm. Okay, I thought I had to find the stone of worry, but apparently I have to light all the... All of the torches. I was not expecting a... Well, let's continue. Puzzle so soon. It's not so loud. So, three signs of Alm, then a dash, or is it two dashes? This huge oath is breaking my heart. Okay, so I need the thing it asked me now. What? What or how does that help me? door has opened somewhere in the castle. Oh, now you tell me that a door has opened in the castle after I go and open it. Signs of all get a dash. I guess you go down the rabbit hole. Hmm. Uh, just more stuff to sell. Eliminate the Baron.
Well, I guess they'll have... Uh... Hmm. I guess they'll have another surprise waiting for us. Okay, time to start the old motor again. to do that combat. I don't know, let's start to explore the castle before we do anything like that because I don't want to do more quests right now, I just want to finish the ones that I have. But in other words, I don't want to do new quests. Ah yes, the mighty griffin. We have killed some of them already, so that shouldn't be a problem. What kind of a chicken is that? It's a mighty griffin. Okay, so instead of a royal griffin, it's a mighty griffin. And what did they change the color scheme? All they change is the color scheme. Man, this developer really cut a lot of costs. And it's the same for the bears. The bears... The only difference between a bear and an ancient bear is kind of like their color. So let's hear the <laughs> griffins and the mighty griffins. <laughs> don't lose much, they don't, get mu they don't gain much. You can see this is the uh, rank 3 griffin compared to the level rank 1 griffin is the same. Sorry about that, the hiccup. I don't know what to say about this. I mean, yeah, it's going to be hard fight, but still. Oh, of course they're hiding in places I cannot hit them in range. Let's fight. Uh, can I hit any of the griffins? Probably yes. Okay, so those are the regular griffins. Hmm. I guess I should keep my bleeding. Oh, they are ancient wolves. That means they do something else because they're ancient and spooky and mysterious, right? Nothing really scares me in the game except for that thing. That thing looks so menacing. Mm, should have used the armor piercing shot. Oh well. Oh, that's just a normal bear left over there. Okay, go and kill the griffins at least. Mm, no other option over here. Let's 
so range tool for just one against many. Okay, fire away. Oh, the definitions are so delayed. And I only lost one unit. Ancient Wolves. So the Ancient Wolves are level 4. They have 1000 leadership requirement and have 315 HP. Man, this is so, so weird. I guess this would be a great place to paint. But then again, we still have a job to do. I think our job is still to save the world. I'm not sure <laughs> what is my job. We seem to be running around and telling people not to be mean anymore. This is under the bridge. Hello, Mr. Nikas. You must be Brian's grandfather. How did that sniveling wimp ever manage to make it so far from home? What? My grandson is anything but a wimp. Before he left, he declared in no uncertain terms that he intended to be a free man. What happened? Well, he joined up with a band of other free men. Your grandson Brand became a bandit. Shortly thereafter, the leader of this gang of ne'er do wells kidnapped his betrothed. She's angry with Brand, but still wants to marry him. To be more precise, she wants him to propose. In order to do this, he needs to become braver somehow. What a resourceful young mate. If I were twenty years younger, I'd be competing for her heart myself. So what was her name again? The name of your grandson's bride is Marlena. Marlena, huh? We must help Bran win the fair maiden again. I have an idea. All we need is a drop of fire blood. Do you know about fire spirits? They'd make for an excellent amulet of bravery. On the other hand, my books. I don't understand. Never mind the finicky details. Heroes like you generally shouldn't. Tell you what, let's tell your fortune instead. Which do you choose? The book or the sword? What? The book or the sword? So the sword is for the power, yes. A real fortune. I wish I had been there, fighting evil alongside King Maximus. Hmm. We have a new book quest. A new. A new quest with books. Oh, it's in his back garden.
<laughs> so it is. Well, I should have imagined it will be a battle. No water. Equal enemy, you say, huh? Oh, level one unit. <laughs> Like this is this is the only time you shouldn't fight fire with fire. Hmm. Okay, let's just start as it is. So. Get a clear shot, so we wait. That's a very really nice ability. Sending in the cannon fodder. No more eyes for you. It was does this spell do? <laughs> it's more or less the same attack apparently. Who incinerated the fire elemental? That's pretty hilarious. Okay, we're making some progress, but the progress is only slow. Well, that will be very hard to kill from this range, but let's try it anyway. Hmm, 
Do they still have Frost Blade up? I don't think they have it. Or do they? They choose to buff this guy? Why? Well, this will be a very good flank. <laughs> the Iron Golems got killed by the crossbowmen again. Yeah, that was not so hard. It was a little annoying in the beginning, but I guess it's okay. There, there can't be many golems, so if they don't have a lot of leadership, they will not be able to pose a threat to you. One, eh, we just lose a little bit of gold. So let me guess, this entire area is here just to have us fight the golems. Yeah, just for us to fight the golems. I mean, this is basically still on the same dimension, only we have a giant portal up there. What's that mechanical noise? The game is weird again. Is it actually complete the quest or do we need to do something else? Well, well, I guess this will be enough for today. One of the things that keeps me calm is eating while playing the game and also not commenting too much on what's happening because the story is so nonsense. It's so much nonsense. I guess if you pick the the book, you'll have a a more range-oriented fight or something. Master Nikas, why didn't you tell me that picking the sword would lead to a fight? What kind of fortune teller would I be then? Oh no, it was your magic that chose this path. Did you succeed in obtaining a drop of fire blood? Here it is, fiery. Oh yes, that's it. Wait a few moments while I fashion the amulet. Step aside and watch a genuine mage at work. I think I was at the Mage Academy and saw a lot more mages than you. So it's Hocus Pocus Materialize Amulet. Is that the amulet for Brand? That was quick work. <laughs> it's quite a good one too. This should help Brand. I know what my grandson is like. Brave heart amulet. Okay, can I keep it? No, I cannot keep it. This is what bothers me so much about the game. We have so many nice choices, but no. The choices are always going to be you get an amulet, deliver it. A bell? Why would there be a bell here? 
I don't know why would there be loot in the tree, tr tree trunks. Uh, to summon something for me to fight, probably. I guess I scared him with my approach. So it's actually like a Diggler, like a Pokemon. Okay, so if they look at me, they'll be scared. <laughs> and people call this gaming How are you supposed to do this? I mean, I'm using the speed mod, but... I have no idea why this is like this. Or, or. Oh yeah, very, a lot of nonsense, now what? Don't tell me I have to walk. I don't have to deactivate my mod to get the stone because I have to walk. Uh, come with me. Go, Pokeball. This troll looks so pitiful. What if I give him the stone? <laughs> that's so silly, that's so silly. Windy port fair, okay, that was one of the weirdest things I ever done in a game. We have to we had to catch a diglet or whatever Pokemon that was by slowly approaching it. Did you have any rings that increases my crit chance? No. I guess you can wear the assassin gear. Okay, I'll do this quest and then the Bernard one. Anarchy or order? Well, I guess I'll have to go for order. <laughs> Let's go for anarchy. Let's give the stone to the troll. Keep it down, sir troll. Sir troll. Signs of all, then a dash, and there's two dashes. 
Yeah, e porciul, I guess he needed a friend. Calm down, little little baby. Therefore, I am hungry. Good job. Oh, he can speak. You speak Nostrian? I am either, either hungry. You win higher troll. Give food half troll. Yes, very much. Very much food or very much troll. Oh, so they give me a stone skin troll. <laughs> okay, that's a little bit hilarious. If you remember, I actually lost my stone skin troll a while back, but I guess... I guess now we have him back. So I have the level 2 trolls, the level 3 trolls, stone skin trolls. And then the level 4 ones, which are not so different from the level 3 ones, the troll chieftains. And what changes for them? Well, I guess they look a little bigger, they have a rope with more skulls, yet yeah, more skulls and a bigger tree trunk. The weapon seems more... I don't know. They should have the same weapon as the stone skin trolls. This one looks very primitive. I guess it has a sword in it. This one has just a... something in it. More crit, more damage, more health. Yeah, it's just a stat increase. I mean, for 400 leadership, this is what they change about them. A little bit more damage. Pacify. Stunned. Oh, they also apply weakened. And then we cannot counter attack. Brutal force. Okay, I guess that works for us. Hey, what was that other guy? Bring the ashes or snow. No matter for snow. Um. I guess he just leaves the place after you give the stone to the troll. Okay, we have a place to recruit trolls, which is actually led by a troll. Which we'll never use because the trolls are so weak in this game, especially because of their abilities and their set damage. They can die so fast. Now, what is that coward? Oh, he's in that camp. Okay, this is probably one of the quests that took us the longest time to complete. Simply because it was kind of out of our reach. So let's do the quest. Hey, Brandt. Oh, he's outside of the gates. Hey, I remember you. It's not often someone is willing to help a loser like me. Loser like me. I hope Marlena's happy without me. I'm so happy you remember Marlena. Your grandfather <laughs> fashioned an amulet of bravery for you. Put it on. Really? Grandpa? Is he... Is he angry with me? No. Not at all. Go ahead and put it he, on. He gave okay, us a I gift will. for you. Whoa, I'm getting the strangest feeling. That cleaver dared kidnap my girl. Killing was too good for that swine, but at least I'll see justice done for Marlena. Marlena yeah, that comes first. It works. My girl, so brave, so smart and resourceful. I will marry her. I can't see why I hesitated before. What if she's forgotten you by now? What if she refuses? You will come to the wedding. I had the wedding. I want you to see how happy I can make her. Was the amulet? Brief have the amulet, not the amulet of. Confidence. We really have to go to the wedding. This game is really losing its marbles. Go to the wedding. That's a quest in the game. 
Go to the wedding. Go to. Oh, hello, Brent. Can we at least leave the bridge and find some shade? Stay where you are. He's actually running to its own to his own wedding, even though we don't know if she accepted or not. Eh, too bad I'm faster than you. Did I ever came over? I don't remember coming over here. Maybe I did. Okay, I really want this guy to be happy. I hope he's happy. was so much more than he appeared my dear girl, really nice chicken you've always been the only one to believe in me you can see for yourself how he's changed uh I, I didn't mean that what i meant to say is that he's become the man he always was deep inside it sounds incredible but he gave me a new ring not the one i gave you he an illyrian chick a gift, an illyrian chick Wherever did he oh, get such so a thing? Oh, it's so pretty. I have no idea what to do with such a rare bird. Here, why don't you take it? But I don't know what to do with it either. Keep it yes, as a pet. Please accept it. We don't have any money, but an Illyrian chick is <laughs> worth a small pile I guess of he gold. was a also, successful bandit. Thank you. If it weren't for you, I'd still be a sniveling milksop. May Elihu watch over you. <laughs> Does he have to wear that amulet forever now? I am so lost. Oh, it's a, it's an amulet. <laughs> it's an amulet. Really, they gave me a chicken amulet. They gave me a chicken amulet. They gave me a chicken amulet. <laughs> That was the whole quest, that was the reward, that was everything. I mean, it was worth it, but still, it's it's really breaking the immersion of the game for me, really. I mean, hiding trolls from trolls is okay, but that one with the chicken. I'm not sure much about that. It has to find Xandor Quint. I guess this is the guy that sells us the trolls, because he's... We have more than one troll tamer over here. Wait for the quarantine to be lifted. Fight the spirit Aldor. I guess we can go over here and then end the video. That was one weird episode over now, over here, over now. I mean, it's over now. Okay, let's see what kind of a recruiter is that over there and then I'll end the video. I guess you have to find a way to go on top of the castle. What? Are these? what? Oh, they are. Tomatoes. Are you off your ruddy gourd? We barely escaped with our lives and you stole somebody's tomatoes? Come on, the bandits must have killed the tomato monger along with everybody else. Okay, that's a sad story. Why would you kill the tomato monger? The tomato. 
guy. Well, I guess next episode we'll need to fight this band of merry bandits, get the tools and then go over here or use that bridge over there to get over there. I'm not sure, we'll just have to see. Okay, we are game. See you next time. Bye.